Why, hello everybody, good afternoon, hi, aha, welcome. Uh, it's uh, it's Wednesday, isn't it? It's Wednesday today, wow! Wednesday, the 24th of May, 2023, it's going to go down in history as the day that we started a brand new series today. Oh, it's Luigi's Mansion 3, oh, lovely, um, yes, continuing our Luigi's Mansion series, I assume. Um, we finished the first game uh, a couple of weeks ago, a few weeks ago. Uh, today we're, we're going straight to the third one. Why are we going to the third one? Well, I kind of explained it last time around. Uh, of course, Luigi's Mansion 2 
is technically Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, and that was on uh, the 3DS. I don't own that game. I don't even own a copy of the game, let alone do I own a pirated copy of the game. Uh, so we're not going to play that one. At least not now, anyway. Um, I don't know. Maybe the maybe the, the minds at Nintendo will somehow make that available. I don't know. Uh, so we're jumping straight to number three. Uh, this is, the, of course, the game that came out on Halloween, I believe, in 2019. Can't believe it's nearly like three and a half, four years ago. Um, I remember playing this one and it was uh, quite a fun game. Played it like, as I say, like three and a half years ago. So um, should be should be fun, this one. Looking forward to it. Um, I think it's probably escaped my mind to the level that I've forgotten exactly what to do and therefore it should be an enjoyable play and uh, of course we'll be stripping it across the next many months um, playing uh, a different uh, episode every kind of few weeks or so so um, we'll get into it today and we'll find out what's going on it's gonna be fun uh, if you're watching live today as with any of the live streams on the channel you can get in touch and let me know what you think of the game maybe you played this one recently maybe you played it ages and ages ago uh, let us know. Let me know in the uh, live chat. Just tap that live chat button. Uh, say hi and uh, let me know that you're out there today. Uh, where's the live chat button? There it is. Yes, yeah, sorry. Hi. Um, get in the live chat. We'll read out some messages throughout today's episode, of course. Uh, if you enjoy things, don't forget to tap that thumbs up to give this video a like and get subscribed to the channel for more like this each and every day. Normally Monday to Friday, quarter past five. And of course, don't forget to turn on those notifications so you get the little pop-up reminder to pop up and remind you whenever I go live. Uh, just like that. Lovely. Uh, I'm just catching up on the chat. What's this about? Hang on. <laughs> Logan. Logan, what's a kiwi fruit? What? What's a kiwi fruit for? I don't know. Confusing. And what's the, what's the private top? I'm really... Logan, you've really confused me. What's going on? I don't know. Anyway, forget that. Uh, let's get into the game. I think the audio is really quiet for some reason. We might have to tweak this. Let's have a, let's have a little listen. Wow, yeah. It's as if I'd not even turn it on. It's there in the background. I have a feeling, though, that like, all the menu noises are going to like be really loud. <laughs> Uh, okay. I think I might need to address this. Is there like some settings somewhere in the game where I can put music up? Oh, hang on a minute. Tell you what, hang on. Close close your eyes and close your ears. I'm just going to hop into this game because I don't think there are options. This is the game that I played um, in my own time, as I said. Uh, that was Well, that was it. I think the 14th of November, but I obviously loaded it up this morning just to check graphics and stuff. Just see, what, what's the deal with the sound? <laughs> Spoiler alert, by the way, you're about to see potentially the ending of the game, I think. <laughs> um, hang on, settings. Settings. Adjust, no, I can only adjust the brightness and the controls. Okay, well maybe it's just, maybe it's just a little quirk of the beginning of the game. I don't know, maybe the menu is just like, um, a bit quieter. I don't know. I don't know. What a great start to the series, though. <laughs> uh, starting here. Oh, look, Luigi's Mansion 1.3.0. That's out now. I think it's been out for a while. I never touched any of this content. What is the, the scare scraper? It's a 20 floor mode. Uh, with rare ghosts waiting to be captured. You can now enter the Scream Park games with only one player. I, I must admit, never played any of that. Don't know. Um, right. Story. And let's start a brand new game. Let's go file two. <laughs> Create a new game. Yes, please. Game saves automatically. Very good. Good to hear. Uh, I'm gonna like play around with the volume for the beginning then. Let's see what happens. Yeah, we can hear the menu noises. Oh, there we go. Ah. Oh, it's very loud. See? It's a bus! In the hills! It's lovely graphics, this one. And it's been driven by Toad! It's 
Toad actually got a driving license. <laughs> oh, <whoops. laughs> Essentially not. Mario's here, Peach is here, Blue Toad's here, Yellow Toad's here, and so is Luigi. Oh, he's very tired. Oh, and, and this this chap's here. I think he's a character in Dark Moon, isn't he? Oh. He seems very happy, though. Despite being a ghost. Oh. Oh. Oh, look at this. It's a fancy hotel. Oh, yeah. Yep. Ha -ha. Oh, wow. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. Come on. It's like they're going on a holiday. Look at all the luggage. That's why all the toads are here. <laughs> Luigi's packed lightly. Luigi's only got the one case. Yeah. You're right, has it? It's just like the movie. Come on. Oh. Wow. So easy. Imagine if the movie just had like everybody going, wow. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's a big one. Uh, so, yes, the premise of the game is we've arrived at this fancy hotel. Look. Oh. What could possibly go wrong here? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. Oh, that's Polterpup, isn't it? I just I just looked it up. Look at this! It's got funky hotel music as well, you know. People think this game is scary. It's lovely. Um, okay, we're in control. What what's going on? Let's go speak to everybody. Speak to Mario. Mm. Uh hey Mario. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh, piece of cake. <laughs> Doggy. Uh, Spitz Peach. See what see what words of wisdom she's got for us. Hi. Ah, <gasps> uh, this hotel is so big, Luigi. It's gorgeously decorated too. We're so lucky to have gotten an invitation to come here. He he. Bye. Bye. What about the toads? Red toad. OG toad. Her. Princess Peach definitely didn't forget to pack anything. <laughs> <gasps> Luigi, what's up? <laughs> oh no! Oh no, the toad is stuck! Blue toad is stuck! Somebody get him out! <laughs> My head is stuck! I can't get out! <laughs> They've got such character. Anyway, we should check in, shouldn't we? Let's check in a reception. I mean, this, this guy looks... Positively delightful. He's so happy to see us. <laughs> why, why are you ringing the bell? He's literally in front of us. Uh, welcome guests to The Last Resort. Are we ready to check in? Yes, we are, I guess. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, hello. Guests. It sounds like The Sims. Welcome to The Last Resort. My name is Helen Gravely, and I am the owner of this hotel. I'm absolutely delighted that you decided to accept my invitation. What kind of hair product does she use? Look at it. You all must be very tired. Come, allow me to show you to your rooms. Oh, no need to worry about your luggage. Our exceptional staff will take care of it for you. Ha ha ha. 
<laughs> You're our VIPs after all. Uh, we've prepared a first-rate experience for you. All the trappings of luxury. Shall we get going? How much power is she putting on? Oh god, oh god, it's like me. <laughs> Luigi, you need a you need one of these. You need one of these devices. <laughs> Touch wood, I'm alright today. Everyone in the lift. Oh. It does sound like she's speaking Simlish. Level 5. Oh, yeah. Ah, thanks. Mario, Luigi, and Peach's rooms are over here. We've prepared rooms for you, Toads, as well. I hope you enjoy your stay. I dare say you'll remember it for the rest of your lives. Ha ha ha. Evil laugh. <laughs> Such a wonderful start, this game. Bye bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. Night night. Night night. Oh, it's so cute. Oh. oh. Of course, Pulse Pup doesn't need to use the door. And then we're in. Look at this! Look at this luxury in here! There's a fruit basket, there's balloons. We're bathed in wonderful golden light. Look, the luggage is already here! What a trip! We've got tea. Oh, it's more more amenities than, than I've got at home. Um what can I, uh, can I interact with anything then? Can we interact with Pup? Woof! Time to rest. No, not yet. Let's, let's explore. Can I get my suitcase out? No. Can we, uh, oh, we can open. Oh, there's a little go, uh, joke hand. Ah, how funny. <laughs> uh, evening, James. James says, um, still one of the best looking games on the Switch. Absolutely. Hey! Jokes are plenty, isn't there? There you go. Um, what's what, the presents as well? We've got presents? What? Nothing in there. Can I? Oh no. no, no, no. Anyway, I think we're supposed to go to sleep, aren't we? I mean, it is absolutely bathing in sunlight outside, so I don't know why we're going to sleep. Maybe we've travelled far. Um, maybe we've got jet lag. I don't know. Yeah. Ah. What's in the case anyway, Luigi? Uh -huh. <gasps> oh! Uh, yeah. Of course, his trusty Ooh. flashlight. <laughs> his diary. Yeah. And his spare pair of overalls. Oh, I'm wearing green today, I just noticed. What a what a sheer accident. <laughs> I haven't got dungarees on though. <laughs> Out like a light. Fair enough. <gasps> uh oh. Oh no. Oh, something's happened. Oh, we've been overtaken by, like, thorns. And the balloons, they're all evil. Um, is the little happy emoji guy still in here? Oh, no, he's not. Blimey, shut that up. Um, okay. I think we've got to go outside. Oh, I never went in the bathroom, did I? Is this... Oh, we got a rat. We've got a rat in the bathroom. I can't really do anything at the moment, because I've no, oh, no means of interacting with anything, have I, other than pressing X all the time. We can run the tap. <laughs> let's go out into the corridor, let's see what's going on. Um, I'm just stalling for time. <gasps> oh, uh. Twilight Zone. Well, oh, 
That's Peach's luggage. They love putting mirrors in games, don't they? They, lo they did it all throughout Luigi's Mansion, the original on the GameCube. And they did it all in this one. Here's Mario's case. Oh, there's, oh, there's a spider. Can't do anything with that. I guess the, are these all locked? Oh no. Oh no, Mario's room's trashed. I think he did this. There's pizza everywhere, isn't there? Probably was Mario. Oh. Um. Then the toads have a room down here. I don't remember it being this evil. I thought one. Oh, <laughs> the toads have barricaded themselves out of the way. Uh, can we go in the lift? No. No amount of pressing is bringing us a lift. Okay, um, try some of the other rooms. Oh, this is gonna be Peach's room, though. We've got Peach style luggage everywhere. Oh. At least she had time to unpack. <laughs> oh, jeepers. Um, okay, I think we've got to go to the other end of the corridor. I love the attention to detail though in this game. <laughs> oh, oh hang on, the lift's kicked in. <gasps> Someone's here. <gasps> it's Helen Gravely everybody. Well, 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 if it isn't my most esteemed VIP, I was just on my way to see you. Is your room living up to your expectations? Doesn't it scream good taste? <laughs> oh, I can barely contain myself. You have no idea how much I wanted you to accept my invitation. Why is that? I'm sure you're wondering. Ha ha ha, you see. There is someone I truly adore. He's the inspiration for some of my greatest ideas, like inviting you here. I'm such a huge fan of his, and that's why it's so wonderful that I get to introduce him to you. That's right, Luigi. I hope you're ready. Oh no, it's King Boo! Surprise, Luigi! It's a me, King Boo! That old coot had me locked up tight in his lab. But guess what? I got out! The hotel owner here was just dying to meet me, so she busted me out. Pretty lucky, huh? Anyway, I didn't think you'd actually show up here. I was ready, though, just in case. In fact, my vengeance is nearly complete. What do I mean by vengeance? Glad you asked. I'm trapping you and everyone in your little vacation party in frames! It's happening again! There, there, Luigi. It'll all be over soon. It's time for a family reunion. Booyah! Oh no, there they are. Oh no! Oh no. <laughs> Take that. Oh, and there's one more frame, of course. I saved it especially for you. Stay right there and put on your best terrified face, Luigi. This is game over. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no, thank you. No, thank you. Run for the hills, Luigi. Run for the hills. Oh, my. Oh, it's very loud. Oh. Uh, looks like we're going in the laundry chute. Oh no! <laughs> oh. What's the worst? The picture frame or the laundry chute? <laughs> well. 
that's just the prologue. Oh, and here it is in its full spooky splendor. Oh, it's giving me chills. <laughs> Where is the shoot taking us? Come on, game. Come on. <laughs> oh, hey, uh, Pulse Pup's here. <laughs> I love the garbled little bits of English that Luigi does. <laughs> Uh, well, of course, the laundry chute has brought us to the laundry room. So I can't do anything still, can I? I can't, I can't really interact with anything. Oh, no, no, tell a lie. I can interact with things. I just, like, there's loads of coins and gold everywhere, and I can't interact with them. Oh, there we go. No, I've got two Gs. Lovely. Um, run, run the towel. <laughs> oh, there we go. Three Gs. Oh! Towels, yeah. Uh, Logan says, be thankful there were some towels. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, 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 look in there. There's a gem. Like an emerald thing. Hang on. Can I get it out? No. Damn, it's mid-cycle. Of course, you can't turn a washing machine off mid-cycle, can you? <laughs> Come back here. Um, oh, more laundry. <laughs> Let's follow Pulse Pup through here. Oh, he's here, rummaging, rummaging in the bin. He's got donuts. Uh, we follow him in here. <gasps> Into the car park. God, this hotel has everything, doesn't it? Underground car park. Oh, rats. Uh, coins. <laughs> Look at this rather vintage looking car. Can we uh, mm -hmm. interact with this bad boy? Hmm. <laughs> oh, oh. He gets everywhere, this one, doesn't he? Look at that! That looks familiar, doesn't it? <laughs> Fits like a glove. <laughs> oh, hang on, what's he, what's he, what does he want to know? What? Oh, it's a, like a super upgrade to the flashlight. Okay, we can uh, supercharge it with A to do like a bright beam of light. We can hold ZR to suck. And ZL to blow. And together to let out a little pulse like that. Suck and blow at the same time. Is that what happens when you... Uh, push the brake and the accelerator at the same time on your car, I think it is. <laughs> Certainly goes bang. Um, woof! Are we comfortable with what we learned? Yes, I am. Thank you. Pulse pup. <laughs> now what? <gasps> hmm. It's a bit unfair that you can go through walls like that. Um, I'm so tempted to go back to the, uh, the old laundry room to go and get some more money. Now that we can... Suck things up now. Oh, it's all coming back to me. Look at all this. Money! Everywhere. There's something beyond there as well, isn't there? Um ba -ba 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 -ba. where was it down here? Oh. Gotta remember X is the door button. Because I keep pressing um keep pressing A. Oh. Uh -huh. I've come in here for the money. Where's the money? Show me the money. There's some money up here. 
Like, who just leaves, like, bundles of cash lying around on the laundry shelves? Careless. Oh, more money here. Oh. Uh, I've realized it. I realized a slight error in that the money counter is behind my face, isn't it? So, I'll keep you all updated with how much money we've got. And I'll, um, occasionally take my face away. 381 at the moment. Right, hang on, get this bit of get this bit of gold and then we'll be out of here. Oh hang on more more green bills. I can't remember what the role of money is in this game. Is it is it similar to the last one? The more money you've got, the more satisfying the ending is, I don't know. Six two five. Storming. Can I ah More money! <laughs> Suck all the towels up. Goodness me, this blooming, um... This vacuum's got, like, max capacity, isn't it? It's no blooming Dyson, this. There you go, 757. Can I, can I disable the washing machines? I don't know if I can. Or if I can, I can't do it yet, I don't think. Do I just open the door? Oh, wow. I don't do that. I don't know. Anyway, note to self, there's like an emerald thing in there. Well, that come back. Uh, we are going here. Uh, we've got to follow the pup then, haven't we? Where, where did old pup go? Suck it all up. Um, he went upstairs, didn't he? How do I get up there? Maybe there was another... More money. There's, there's money everywhere! What's down this side? Oh, more money! More money! Oh, I just realised this game has gyro aiming as well! Oh, perfect! That was my biggest complaint about the GameCube game that we just played, was the fact that everything was on the C-Stick and it was so finicky to aim. Whereas this one, I can at least aim up and down with gyro. Perfect. Uh, hang on, what's, there's a gem there. Can I redeem that gem? No, not yet. Lift. Oh. Hang on, what's this about? Oh, yeah. I've just spotted the money tree. Hang on a minute. More money, please. Thank you. <laughs> if only it was as easy in life. Uh, where are we here? Vending machine? I can't... Oh, there we go. Ooh. Oh, so those little, um... Those little flashing indicators seem to be a prompt to press A. Good to know. More money. <gasps> a chest! gonna be I've already got like over a thousand G's complete the game already more money look at my G's got loads of G's <laughs> uh, I seemingly can't go up here because this is in the way wow. oh yeah. it was in the way it's not no longer Oh. It's a bit dusty there, isn't it? Oh, there's a gem there, look. How do I get to that? Wow! Hmm. To be continued, I think. 
Aww. Now, hang on, this is the ground floor, isn't it? Where we were before. There's a gem. Whoa! Oh. I don't know if I want to go in there yet. Just tidy the place up. Uh, is this where we entered? Yeah, this is where we came into the hotel first up, wasn't it? Everyone's got an X on their face. Even Luigi. Which isn't quite right, because we're here. <laughs> oh no. But we're locked in. straight in then. Okay, um, so A to use the flashlight and suck. Oh. Where have you gone? Where have you gone? Oh, I've got to pull the opposite way, haven't I? There we go. And then I can slam them here and slam them there. There we go. Good bit of slamming. What, what have you got to say? Oh! Oh. Cheers, pup. Oh no, there's more ghosts. There's one up here. The ghosts of reception. Oh no, he's just taking a big chunk out of me. How rude. Get your friend. There you go. <laughs> Ah, oh, it's very satisfying, is that move. Where are you? Blimey. Um, okay. What's this about? Oh. I don't know, I blew it up. Uh... Oh, a heart. Grab that. Uh, up the stairs, maybe? Or behind reception. Oh, oh yeah, there's a little flashing light behind reception. I can't, I can't get to that though. Can I get in here? Oh, there we go. <laughs> That's an alright kerfuffle. Um, oh, and there's loads of gold in the safe. Oh, there's a key! There's a key! Hung up. I've just spotted that. We've got a key. Uh, what's that gonna do? Oh, hey, we'll have that. A little gem. More money. Sorry, pup. We're just uh, busy uh, wrecking the joint. like 2,000 G's now. I'm assuming there's going to be like collectible gems then, because there's another one up there, isn't there? I don't know how I get to that. Oh! Hello? Okay. <laughs> Thanks. I can't get that from here. I don't know... I don't know how I'm supposed to get these things. We've seen a few of them around though, haven't we? Um, upstairs, go see what Pup wants. Hello? In here? Yes? Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Good job we got a key, hey? Oh. Oh, <gasps> e-gad!
our old friend the professor is stuck in a painting. Uh, how do we get him out? We can't just suck him out. Um, I'm gonna follow up through here then. Just check the bins. Oh, money. Surely is my motivation in this game, isn't it? Money. Oh, oh we can't get in there. We need a key. Damn it, pup. Um, hey, consult the map. Uh, where have we been then? We've just been in the ballroom, haven't we? Uh, which I guess is that room there. That that looks to be like the storeroom, doesn't it? The perfume room? Directly ahead. Some toilets and a dining room. Okay, uh, something to do with a fire escape, I, I reckon. Um... Can I get out of here? No, I can't. But can I go in here? I can. I was just trying to get this out of the way because there's a safe here. What's in the safe? Oh! Oh, gems. Oh, there's loads of different kinds of gems then. Like an oval gem. <gasps> a bag of G! Hey! Uh, this, uh, this series loves to put things in mirrors, doesn't it? I've already spotted that there is a lit up button here. Now, is this the fire alarm, do you reckon? Oh, it's the key. We'll mm -hmm. take that. Why is the key hidden behind the bazaar? Whoa, <laughs> yes. Oh yeah. Uh, that's the key that we need to get in the room next door, then, isn't it? I don't think there's anything else in there for oh. us for now. <gasps> oh. This guy plastering like Luigi posters everywhere. <laughs> Come here, you. Get him! <laughs> oh, yes! I hope this key gets us in this room, then let's have a look. Yes. Uh -huh. We've got some paintings in here. Oh, we've got to find a way, right? We've got to find a way. Presumably we can turn paintings into whatever's in the painting at some point. Because that's going to give us a load of money. Uh, yes, let's light up the safe. This isn't the most secure way of having a safe, is it? <laughs> What's in the safe? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, it's another upgrade for our flashlight. Uh -huh. Ta -da. Oh, oh, look at that. It's some kind of mesmerizer. <laughs> I think this is what I was after then. So, if I hold X in front of a painting... It turns whatever's on the painting into real life. This is going to be perfect for our adventure. Uh, I've also just spotted a little golden spider up here. How do we get him down? There we go, like that. Um, there's another chest behind here as well, look. Can we get to that? More money. Shake a stick at. Uh, there's lots of spiders in here. Maybe we'll come back.
back to this bit in a bit. Right, um, can we... Reveal what's on here. Oh, there's a piggy bank! Oh, that's the piggy bank from, um... From Paper Mario Color Splash. I remember that one. So much junk. Can I mesmerize this? No. Can't. Okay, never mind. Let's get out of here. Uh, well, now presumably we can go back to see Egad in the painting and we can mesmerize him. Don't know if that's the technical term, by the way. Hello. Seems appropriate, though. Here he is. He hasn't aged a day, has he? Since the last game. <laughs> Partly because he was so old to start with. Hey. If it isn't Luigi, you are precisely the last person I'd expect to find here. Hold that thought. Now isn't the time to catch up. What matters is, you'll do nicely. Come on, Luigi. Get me out of here now. Uh, this hotel is filled to the brim with ghosts. Let's make a run for it. Mario? <gasps> Mario? What is that? Uh, all of your friends have been captured? And you can't just abandon them here, you say? Ugh. You're the same as ever, I see. A bit of a handful. Okay. I'm not thrilled about it, but I, Professor Elvin Gad, have an idea. First things first, Luigi. We have to get to my car. Uh, will you take me there? Uh, the new Poltergust G00 you're wearing. Uh, you took that out of my car, right? We've got to get back to the underground garage. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Look at the way he runs. <laughs> Can we just parade around here for a bit, just so Egad just has a little, uh, little moment? It's in the ballroom after all. No, back to the garage. Come on. <laughs> it's like he's doing a limbo dance. Uh, Luigi, take a look over there! <gasps> the elevator will get us to the garage in an instant! Let's hurry up before the ghosts find us! That's a good point, actually. I didn't take the elevator down, did I? I uh, up. I kind of just went straight for the stairs. Uh, hang on. Let's get that out of the way, don't we? There we go. Uh, Luigi, look at that! It's money and lots of it, even with all the dangers here. I'm sure we agree that money is still important. The ghosts don't seem interested in grabbing it. What's the saying? You can't take it with you? Well, I definitely want it anyway. Uh, keep your eyes peeled and grab as much as you can, you know, while you're capturing ghosts and saving your friends. Multitasking! Sure. We'll call a lift while we're at it. In we go! Uh, oh, I've got to actually, like, call the lift uh, to where we want it. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, of all the... Oh, someone has removed all the other elevator buttons. What's going on here? Hmm. A mystery for later, I suppose. Go ahead and give that B1 button a push. Uh, there. <laughs> hmm. Get him quivering. Uh, it didn't seem like any of your friends were trapped on the second floor with me. They must have been taken to one of the floors higher up in the hotel. Which means, yeah, we're gonna need those elevator buttons. Sure. Oh, we're here. Out we go. Uh, yes, this is the floor that we were on, wasn't it? So we know already that the parking garage. Oh! <laughs> you. That's it. For, for that, I'm going to blind you. Um, oh, there's money up in the ceiling, look. Hang on. How do we get that? Like that. Got 
Gotta get the money. Oh, and also, hang on, now we've got the mesmerizer thing. I know what to do with this. A square gem. Got it. I'm trying to think if there was another instance of needing that ability. I can't remember. Anyway. Oh, the bellhop guy's here. To, I, say, I need to shock him. Oh no, my battery's running low. <laughs> we'll manage today, I think. Uh, where are you? Where is he? Oh, hang on. There's some rummaging going on here, isn't there? Do I need... I think I need him to chuck that at me first, don't I? Or try, at least. Then go in with this... Okay, what were, what were they? Are they like toilet rolls wrapped in rubber bands? He's here. Oh, oh no. <laughs> ah, damn it. And you're out. And would you look at that? We've got some elevator buttons. Go and grab them. What we got? We got number one and we got number five. Handy. Five, of course, being the floor where we were in the hotel before it all kicked off. Ho, ho. Those are definitely the elevator buttons. I never would have guessed a ghost had taken them. Ah, uh, but there are only two. Maybe there are other ghosts out there with the rest of the buttons. No matter, let's go to my car. I've got something very interesting that I want to show you. Oh. Oh. Pop, pop them in your pocket. Ta da! They're so expressive in this game. What's this? Stand back. Look at that! <laughs> I think he's essentially saying, I'll, I'll meet you in there. <laughs> wow. It's Egad's portable lab. Andy. I could do with one of these myself. Look at all the screens. Uh, welcome to my lab. This is another of my brilliant inventions. A portable laboratory. It's sturdy, safe, and air-conditioned. I always knew I'd need this one day. Good thing I brought it along with me, right? Yeah? Uh, you want to know what I'm doing in this hotel? 
It's a bit of a long story, but in short, I was tricked. I got an invitation from someone claiming to own this hotel. They said they had a precious collection of ghosts gathered from all over the world. No self-respecting ghost researcher would pass up on such an appealing offer, obviously. I accepted their invitation, but when I arrived, the invitation was only a ruse. They captured me and took my precious ghost collection. Ugh, that includes all those ghosts you'd worked so hard to catch for me before. Damn it, Egad. Even King Boo. Losing him really got under my skin. He's my favorite. Huh? What? They've released King Boo? Ah, oh, that hotel owner. What has she done? Luigi, you're our only hope. Against all odds, without any hesitation, and at any cost, get my ghost collection back. And speaking of ghost collections, why don't you give me all of the ghosts you've captured so far? Yeah, sure, we know the drill, don't we? Pop it in here. Alright, uh, keep on catching those ghosts. Oh, and be sure to come back to the lab. I'll set up the gallery so that you can view the ghosts that you've captured. Oh. <laughs> I like his chair as well. I love that he's got like a little remote on it. Uh, what's with that look, Luigi? Am I forgetting something important? Oh, oh, that's right. I forgot about saving your friends and family. Completely and totally forgot. Regardless, to find ghosts and your friends, you'll need to explore this hotel. To help you out, I'll give you one of my greatest inventions yet. Oh, it's the virtual boo! <laughs> the VB for short. Continuing the theme of Nintendo hardware modified in game. Haha, got it. It's a state-of-the-art virtual reality device fitted with a fancy red screen. Really cutting-edge stuff. And red is all rage, you know. Just wait until I finish the marketing materials on this. It'll fly off the shelves. <laughs> uh, you can use the VB to communicate with me at any time. Maybe we can test out the communication system later. Press the plus button to look into the VB and it'll display your current objective for you too. It's quite useful. Oh, and I have one more thing to give you. Another thing? Oh! The very first thing you need to do is install this elevator tracker inside the elevator for me, okay? Sure. As for what it is, I'll tell you later. Go and get it installed. Head for the elevator. I'm counting on you, Luigi. Don't worry about it, Gad. We got it. Um, exit. How do we exit? How do we exit? Explore hotel. That's what we need to do. <laughs> right, let's go put our buttons in the elevator, I guess. We've got a little map now, top right. Still got spiders all over the shop. Still got money. Oh, there are sp oh god, there's... Oh! That thing just hit me. I lost 5 HP for that. Damn it, spider. Uh, okay, well that, that explains why we couldn't go in the elevator before, because there were no buttons in it. I kind of missed that, didn't I? I went straight for that door. Um, but now we can pop the buttons in the elevator. I will put this little tracker thing in as well. Hang on. Hey, hey. Here he is. Hello, Luigi. It seems like the installation was a success. Now then, as to what the device actually does, well, it extracts map data about the floors from the elevator. Then it takes all that data and displays it on the monitor. Isn't that great? Uh, why don't you take out those elevator buttons you collected and insert them into the panel? Yes. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> and another one. Oh, yeah. Very good. 
uh, now you're able to view the map of a new floor. There's another surprise, Luigi. That device links with the virtual boo. The map data is automatically sent to the VB, so you can view the map anywhere, anytime. It's a good slogan, that. Uh, if you open the map from the VB menu, you can check out an even more detailed map. Don't go forgetting about it, okay? Let me break it down for you, Luigi. The map is super helpful for exploring new floors. And while you're exploring the hotel, you should hunt down the elevator buttons. Those buttons will let you reach new floors, ripe for exploration. Oh, and you might find your friends there. <laughs> uh, one more thing before we go, Luigi. We need to do a quick test of the VB's communication system. So open the VB menu and select the EGAD hotline. I'm counting on you, Luigi. So plus for the EGAD hotline. Here it is. <laughs> testing, testing. One, two, three. This is EGAD, resident genius. Am I coming through loud and clear? Fantastic. It appears that the VB's communication system is working perfectly. And that means you can use this to connect, uh, to contact me anytime you need to. If you feel the need to talk to me, just do exactly what you did for the test, Luigi. I may be able to offer some advice in a tough situation. Oh, and uh, you can also check out the log using the very same system. Let me know if that's why you're calling and you'll be able to see your progress. Uh, okay, testing my inventions is fun, but we should get back to work. And speaking of work, I have a job for you. It doesn't stop coming this, does it? So you're able to take the elevator up to the fifth floor now, right? I was actually staying in a room on that floor. There's a briefcase in my room. Could you fetch it for me, Luigi? My room number is... Oh, blast. What was it? Ah, you got a map. You'll figure it out. Good luck, Luigi. Try to come back alive. Um, okay, yeah, we can go uh, to the fifth floor then. I guess until we've explored it. Oh no, we can see we can see where we've been, can't we? So we had room 503, which I think is where we were staying. Um, and 502 and 501. I think um, Mario and Peach were staying in these. It's the fifth floor. It's the RIP suites. Lovely. And then uh, obviously the basement is where we've just been. And the first floor is the grand lobby. And that leads up to the second floor, which we've not unlocked yet. Oh no, there it is. There's a like a mezzanine within the within the room. So there's uh, the ballroom and the, those bits and pieces, the storage room and the dressing room. Okay, lots to explore. We've set the scene quite nicely here, haven't we? Um, I'm going to, I think we're going to pause things here today, for now. I've just uh, downloaded some down, uh, update data as well. Um, I'm assuming I can, can I save? When do I save? Does it always save? I think it always saves. I hope it saves. Fingers crossed. Um, yeah, we've got plenty to explore. Obviously, Egad has told us to go and hunt down his briefcase. I'm sure he's got something delightful inside that that will help us on our quest. And uh, when we return for more in episode two, we will uh, pick up on that. I think it, it's been saving along the every time we've gone through a door. I think. Just go through it. Yeah, there you go, saving. We'll go back in this lobby bit. I feel safer in here. Uh, so yes, next time when we come back to play more of this game in, well, in a little while actually, because uh, I've got a bit of a break coming up, haven't I? But uh, next time, episode two, we'll pick up things right where we left off, head to the fifth floor, and uh, go look for Egad's room and his briefcase. Fingers crossed we will find exactly what is in that, and hopefully it will help us out in the search for our friends. Fingers crossed. That will be episode two of Tom Plays Luigi's Mansion 3 coming soon to the channel. Thank you very much for joining me for this inaugural episode of the series. Looking forward to playing this more and more over the coming months. Hopefully you're going to stay tuned for that too. Um, that's it for today's episode, but no fear. Assuming you're watching live today, uh, there's plenty more coming up for the rest of this week. We are only halfway through the week. We've got a couple more streams coming up this week, and then obviously some more stuff coming up in next week's streams. So let's have a look, shall we? Uh, tomorrow, we're going to be playing some more Super Mario Bros. 3, a.k.a. Uh, Super, Mario Bro uh, Super Mario Advance 4. It's the e-reader levels. And uh, we'll be tackling those tomorrow. They're 
quite fun at those. Uh, quarter past five tomorrow, Thursday night. Friday, it's a free play Friday. Something different to round off the week on Friday. More details on that as the week goes on. Next week, we've got Bank Holiday Monday, so I'm not here on Monday. Tuesday, though, is going to be Overcooked 2 with Aaron. We've got The Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass on Wednesday. And next Thursday, it's the 1st of June. And we're going to be playing some Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. So that is the uh, next five streams coming up from me over the course of the next kind of week or so. Any of those fancy uh, your chances with those? Float your boat, whatever else you want me to say. Uh, get tuned in at those respective days and times. Of course, if you've enjoyed things today, why not tap that thumbs up to give this particular episode an almighty like. And get subscribed to the channel for more like this popping up into your YouTube feed. Normally, each and every day, Monday to Friday, quarter past five, occasionally at different times. But of course, if you've got your notifications on, you'll get a little pop-up reminder to pop up and remind you whenever I go live. Very good. Uh, right, yeah, looking forward to playing more of Luigi's Mansion 3 in the coming months. Thank you very much for watching today. I will see you all the next time when I play games. Ta-ra.